A lot of people have asked me this question lately. What's the easiest way to switch from notability to GoodNotes 5? That's what I'll be talking about in this video. And I'll also be talking about moving from GoodNotes 5 to notability. Hey fantastic humans, it's Ropsy back with Paperless X, a channel that is all about digital productivity. If you're new to this channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Make sure you subscribe if you're looking for solutions to go paperless with your studies or your business. And if you're already subscribed, make sure you turn on your notifications so you know when I release a new video. Notability shares notes to other applications in four formats, PDF, note, image, and rich text format. Of these, only one is editable and the rest are for annotation. Note, which is the editable format, shares your notes as a notability format, which means it can only be opened and edited in notability. When you try to export this format to GoodNotes 5, GoodNotes 5 doesn't even appear in the options of applications you can send this copy to. This leaves you with three options, of which PDF is the most feasible. Considering that Notability is primarily a handwriting note-taking application and that you will probably have some text in your notes, PDF is your best option. And if your notes has audio recordings, the application creates a zip file containing your recording and your PDF file. GoodNotes 5 has no trouble unzipping the file. The only problem is GoodNotes 5 doesn't support audio files, so your recordings folder will be empty. Your PDF notes will be saved just fine. But once in GoodNotes 5, you can't erase anything from the page. You can only make annotations to the notes that you have exported into GoodNotes, just like you would any other PDF that you would put into GoodNotes. What I've explained so far applies to just sending one notebook from Notability to GoodNotes 5. What happens when you want to export all your notes at once? So selecting multiple documents in Notability will give you two options, delete and duplicate. That's the first way. And when you tap this export icon and select multiple documents, you can actually export all your notes. You can opt to share your notes as images and the application will export one notebook but it will only export it as a zip file which they claim to have fixed in the previous update but apparently the application is still creating zip files for multiple images when you export them. They still probably need to work on that feature. Trying to export rich text format RTF with audio files to GoodNotes, the application doesn't even appear in the export option. So I guess that's not an available option. So if you have typed notes, I don't really take typed notes in Notability because that's not what Notability is for. But if you have mostly typed notes and you want to export them as RTF with audio recording, that option is not available for you. The reason it is so difficult to move documents between GoodNotes 5 and Notability is because these two applications don't communicate with each other. Seeing their different applications from different developers that's not really surprising there is no way notability supports goodnotes 5 notes and goodnotes 5 doesn't support notability notes because they're just not best friends like that when exporting out of goodnotes 5 to notability it creates a zip file so with this zip file make sure that the zip file is saved to your files application first this is because notability doesn't support zip files notability doesn't unzip zip files like goodnotes 5 does so you have to unzip your zipped file first then go to notability and import all those documents from the files application you can just import all of them all at once And 
and exporting images is just a bad idea because notability the way it treats images is not really ideal for notes it's good for images if you're going to be resizing them but if you're to export your images to notability they would be small tiny little things that you have to like enlarge to fill the whole page that would be just a lot of work and you really don't want that and obviously the good notes 5 format is not supported by notability so there's no point exporting that if you're changing your applications it's best to keep your notes in the application that you are moving from and just start afresh in a new application just don't make a habit of jumping around from one note from one note taking application to another because you find yourself with notes all over the place and digital notes can get as messy as physical ones just as quickly i hope you guys liked this video give it a thumbs up if you did how many of you guys have switched applications and what was the reason for your switching because some people might learn from your experiences thank you guys so much for watching I will see you in the next video.